Hello, I'm May. Today we're going to learn how to sprout beans for growing. Over here we have um, beans that were dried. Um, they were picked uh, from the end of last season. And these ones have, are white uh, inside and they will grow a yellow bean. And over here we have ones that are dark inside, almost black, and they will grow a green bean. We are going to prepare for soaking and uh, sprouting these beans. So these ones have sat overnight in water, both of them, and which allows the bean to swell up and soak up the water. And then from there we are going to prepare a container. We can use any kind of container. And we're going to put paper towel. And if we don't have paper towel, we can cut a piece of an old sheet and we're simply going to put that in there like that. And then we are going to put the beans, the soaked beans right in there like that. Okay. And then we will cover them again with some more paper towel like this. And again, if you don't have paper towel, you can use an old sheet works great. On the top layer you need to make sure that you have a couple of um, layers of sheet or fabric to cover that so that it doesn't dry out. I'm just cutting an old piece, old sheet here. Um, just to the, something like that and that's gonna help. And I'm going to put a bit more water in there because I want that to be down while it's soaking and if we get a bit too much water we simply can drain it out like that and it should look something like that when it's soaking always always damp always wet and that should sit for four or five days and then you check it every day and you see if those beans are starting to sprout and then when they do then we're going to put them in the ground so you want to keep your beans that you're preparing for sprouting in a place where you can have a look at them every day. And so you're making sure that they're kept damp and um, the right amount of moisture in there because that is key for them to sprout. Some of you may wonder why we use this type of method to sprout the seeds instead of putting them straight into the ground. And the main reason is that they sprout faster because they have an adequate amount of moisture. In the ground they might dry out for a small portion of the time, but here they have a constant supply of moisture. The other seeds that we use this type of method for sprouting are peas, corn, and squash, and cucumber. It's like a jungle in here. On this side we have tomatoes and over here on this side we have peas and down here we have a bean plant this is what it looks like and these are blossoms coming on the top of it uh, which will produce little beans and there you see a little yellow bean right there growing down further on the plant you'll see there's more mature beans and these ones are ready for picking and eating so i'm just going to pick one there and there's another one just to show you this is a yellow bean and they are absolutely delicious hello here we are on day two of sprouting the beans and what's important at this stage is that you are keeping moisture in here water and it's also important that the beans are not floating in water because they'll rot. So you can see there's good moisture in there, but there's not too much. It's also good if they can be kept warm at this stage because they'll sprout faster.